This is the Animation Minute. First up, we have François on a LinkedIn that has a very cool The Dark Crystal turntable. Then back on LinkedIn again, Matei, I hope that's the pronunciation, has a very, very cool Animation Mentor clip here. Go check it out to watch the full clip. On Twitter, Alejandro has a very cool animation here. This is a challenge that people have animated, the frame by frame challenge. So go check it out and check out the challenge in general. Luigi is posting here, I love character design and he has absolutely fantastically cute character designs. I love all these. So go check out his profile for more of his work. Andrew posted a very cool 2D animation cycle. I love anything 2D. It's really nicely done, as he says, you're in TV paint. And he posts a lot of really cool work on Twitter, so check him out as well. Back on Twitter, check out Joe Bowers with a very cool progression reel. You see all of his acting choices and the clip here. And I'm posting the clip later on, so stay tuned for the rest of the animation minute. Hal posted here, Hal Animator's great reference. This is absolutely great reference indeed. So go check this out. You got a really cool view, all in slow motion for proper wing flaps here on a bat. Dan posted here a very quick tutorial on how to animate looping fire. It's very cute. I really like the idea of just the spheres and how it goes into actually nicely animated 2D fire. Again, anything 2D, I love it. Speaking of 2D and especially pixel art, look at that animation. I love it. So check out Bring Peanut Butter for more information on that game. Jamal Bradley is posting a conversation with animators about race. Jamal posts a lot of good stuff. I highly recommend you check out this clip, but his account in general. This Sony event happened and the PS5 reveal revealed a lot of really cool games. So check out this link on Kotaku with some really cool games. This is a fun 2D animation here done on the app Calipeg. Definitely an app that I want to review in the future. Adam School is posting this very cool animation. Go check it out and check out their account and their school as well. Time for jobs. Mike is tweeting that they're looking for a lead technical animator at BioWare. So check out that post. And Nick is tweeting here the trailer for the new Miles Morales Spider-Man game. PS5 reveal revealed that game as well. Nick is posting a lot of cool stuff in general, so check out his account as well. I brought this up here just because of nostalgia reasons. Jurassic Park had a huge influence on me. It's such a fantastic movie and still holds up. And check out this photo. Back to item challenge with this cool animation of that character running faster than the bullets or the laser blast. Very cool idea. I love this. This time, check out the animation mentor post here. I love the little tweaks here with the eyebrows, the eyes, and those arms. It's a very cute mod of those characters. Very cute animation. Check it out. A trailer came out for Myth, A Frozen Tale. I was lucky enough to take a look at an early version of this VR experience. It's very cool. Check out the trailer. And if you can, check out the VR experience. Generally look out for any kind of contract tips. It's always very important to know what to ask for, what to look for before you sign. Back to Jamal, he says here, stay tuned if you work on something and I am very curious what that is. So again, check out his account. Grand Chamaco, if that's a presentation, posts this little alien clip, very cute render. I love the camera in there. It's a cool look. Anyway, thought it was cool, go check it out. If you're interested in the Mandalorian VFX and behind the scenes, there's a great, great series on Disney Plus and the latest episode had a behind the scenes on the making of. So this is what I'm seeing at work. We have access to turntables and witness cams, all kinds of stuff. It's super, super cool. Highly recommend you check it out. Trevor's posting here this shot that he did a year and a half ago, but it's super cool. Go check it out. Back to 2D. Look at that. I love this. Go check out that full thing by Tam. Peter Ramsey is posting about a book that's on Kickstarter, which I back, which is super, super cool with a massive collection of storyboards. So go check it out. Lana is posting here that Gorilla Jobs is looking for a lead creature animator. So check out that post. David here is posting about Stoic Studios looking for a strong senior animator with unreal experience. So again, check out that post. Jude was posting here that Pixar is hiring, but she mentions here June 12th, today is the last day to apply. But a reminder to follow me on Twitter because I do retweet job postings a lot. Check out my blog to look at the trailer for Spice Frontier. You can check it out on other platforms, but I posted that fantastic trailer here. Cartoon Brew posts about the Bay Area Animation Alliance, so check out the link in the description as always with all information or Cartoon Brew for more information there. Ryan's posting that multiple animation positions are currently open at Insomniac Games. So again, another job posting, go check it out. I've done a review of a Long Winter Studio rig and more are coming, but they're adding very cool, fancy elbow and knee options. Always a big fan of that. Harvey is posting more about his experiences and I would check out Harvey's channel either way. 
This is something I actually have never used in Maya. That's cool to see. This is a very cool grease pencil project. Look at this. That looks super cool. Check out that post. Full senior elite animator positions at Frontier. Check out that post for more job opportunities. Awesome artwork by Davison. Check out his account. He posts a lot of really cool work. Another cool example that's on Adam Challenge with a cool idea using the look rake. The Digital Bits tweets about the Kindle versions of the making of Star Wars books. I actually have these and they are super cool on Kindle with the video and audio supplementary material, not just the books. So check those out. If you're looking for more variation in your rigs, check out this thread here on all kinds of rigs that are available. And speaking of rigs, you can check out this tweet here with more character rig options that are out there. Here's a crazy behind the scenes by Kevin Perry. And that is also in the next tweet documenting how he did this. He does a lot of really cool stuff. I highly recommend you follow his channel. Once again, Jamal is posting a very cool animation test here. He's posting a lot of these. So as I said before, check out his account. There's a lot of cool stuff out there. Check out Muli's YouTube channel for Waver, Waver for Maya. It's a tool that he created. It has a very nice uh, demo here with all kinds of options uh, that are explained. So check out his channel. And last but not least, I was retweeting the Star Wars Squadrons reveal. It's actually today, exactly. There I say we are helping out on the cinematics here. I'm working a little bit on this project, not the actual game. It's very cool. So I am very pumped as I'm writing here for that reveal.